Hey everyone, in this video we're going to be assembling the crossover for the Parts Express Amiga Speaker Kit. If you're looking for the full build, check out the description of this video or the product page on PartsExpress.com. Make sure you have a designated heat resistant area as well as solder and soldering tools ready to go. A good tip is to print out the diagram from the Parts Express product page and fasten it to your work area. There are nine components for this crossover seen here, so let's get started. Connect the right side of parts G and C, then part F to the same GC connection. Then attach E to, again, the GCF connection. After that, connect the other side of E to the other side of F. Attach D to the right side of the EF connection. And next, part I will attach to the bottom side of D. Attach part K to the left side of C then bring in part J and attach it to the left side of I. After that, the bottoms of K and J will connect together as well. Lastly, part H will attach to the ID connection, as well as the KJ connection. Solder all the connection points together. Create your leads by using the red and black speaker wire and the soldering ring terminals, which are actually part of the speaker terminals, and connect them together with solder. This is the case for only one set of the black and red wires. The other two require quick crimp connectors on the ends. The positive red input wire will be soldered to the EFD connection point. The positive red woofer wire will need to be soldered to the left side of part G. The positive red tweeter wire will be soldered to the IJ connection point. All the negative black wires will be soldered to the KJH connection point. Feel free to connect your crossover to the inside of the enclosure however you choose. Thanks for watching. Hopefully this helped to complete your kit and put you one step closer to your new sweet setup. 